from the world of Robloxia. It's Robloxia's toughest obstacle course. Divided into four extreme stages, Robloxians face the ultimate test of speed, balance, skill, and against the clock. Many have tried, only five have succeeded. Now let's see who will be the next. Ninja Warrior Roblox. Previously. Wait till I switch? Oh, he slips off. He's gone. Wonderful. I'll fetch for one. Wonderful. I'll take two. Oh, he comes up short. <laughs> Welcome back to Ninja Warrior of Roblox. Last time, nine of the ten stage one survivors took on stage two. Only two managed to clear. Last one left is Grand Champion Reality Pales. Will he join Discord 10 of Ninja Warrior G4 in stage three? Let's find out. Right now. <laughs> we now head back down to the course where Reality Pales is about to get it on. Here he is. Pump to take on stage two. There he goes. Cyclone stairs. Not familiar with these. He's passing, he's on all onto the salmon ladder. Going up at a pretty slow pace, but it doesn't matter because he's got plenty of time. Now onto the skinny bridge. Does it? Oh. Gets a little slip but he's on it. Ah, he jumps a second ledge on the spider walk. That's allowed. Step. Oh, he jumps the second ledge ledge right. Second to last ledge already. That's allowed too. And he's past the spider walk. Now he's on to the unsteady planes. This took him out in tournament four. Can he get past it? Yes, he will. Now he faces the peg jump. He's so close. He's giving different pe pegs. That's good. That saves him time. He's beat it. Now he's on to the levitating ladders. He's still got plenty of time. Is he ready? Climb to the second ladder. He's on it. Third ladder. Come on. Yes! Up he goes! Reality Pales is back into stage 3! Clearing with the fastest time! Well done! Yeah, well done! 27.5 seconds! Reality Pales! Yes! That's the Grand Champion we all know and love! Look at replay! Got through all the obstacles that he's unfamiliar with! In a heartbeat! A little slip on the skinny bridge, but got past it! And he conquered the obstacle that took him out last time he was in stage 2! Went fast with a peg jump! And fast through the levitating ladders, and he will join the other two into stage three. Well done, reality. Glad to have you back in stage three. Before we proceed, let's take a look at the Warrior Wipeout. Oxy Bro may not have gotten far in Spywalk, and his feat was unfortunate, but I think today it goes to Dev1179 for his near slip on the skinny bridge. And eventually wiped out almost in the exact same spot that everyone else did when I got to this obstacle. Stage 3, where 6 of the most difficult obstacles await the following 3 competitors who made it here. They face all obstacles which are all brand new. Starting with the rumbling dice. Rumble the dice all the way to the end. Sure you don't use any. Next up they face the skittle scraps. 6 glows, blue like skittles. They get slimmers or part of the party as you proceed. Then they face on a really difficult obstacle, the shriveling incline cliffhanger. They upgraded the incline cliffhanger. Seven ledges that get thinner as you proceed through it. And yes, I am using um, old footage. And they face the curtain cling. Cling onto the curtain as they make their way to the other end. After that, they face the spider flip. Where they must jump onto the second board and hang onto it as they make their way across it. After that, they face the most difficult obstacle of all. 
the truss slider. Slide the truss all the way to the end, get on top, and jump to the finish platform. While the competitors don't have any time, or are not, do not have a time limit, these are obstacles that will kill them. Will any of them make it to the end? Let's find out as the first one takes on stage 3. It is veteran Dusklore 10. Taking on stage 3 for the very first time. Here Dusklore 10, here we go. He starts with a rumbling dice. No competitors have officially faced this before. Now we're about to see the first one officially do it. Here he is, Dust. The rumbling dice, you gotta rumble it. You gotta make sure it rumbles at least three times before you can make it to the end. You gotta make sure it rumbles to the end as well. Already done it twice. Doesn't matter if it moves, as long as it rumbles at least three times, you're fine. Oh, and he slips through the middle. He's gone. <laughs> mm, Dust Lord out on the rumbling dice. Next up is All-Star Ninja Warrior G4. He heads up the stairs and prepares to take on Stage 3. This is his third time into Stage 3, and the first time since it's, um, um, renewal, so to say, I guess. Alright, Rumbling Dice, here he goes. It's okay, as long as he rumbles it at least three times, it's okay if it moves, because that is a glitch. I'll have to fix it in the next turn to make sure it doesn't happen. Anyway. Alright, it's three times. You can drag it the rest of the way, but it's not really wise to do so. I mean, I may end up changing that the next tournament. He's past it. Now he faces the Skittles Grasp. They get farther apart as he proceeds. And he's going fast on them. He doesn't need to. He can take his time. He's not on a time limit or anything. Let's go. He's done it. Now he faces the Shriveling Incline Cliffhanger. There's two inclines, and the, they get smaller as you proceed. He's on to the small one. He's gotta jump to the second incline. As he the ledges are getting thinner and thinner. Oh, and he misses that six ledge! <laughs> oh no! Two are already out. It's now all to Reality Pales, a grand champion. He is the last man standing. Will he avenge his fallen comrades and advance to stage four, or will he fall just like they did? Let's find out as he takes on stage three the first time since he became a grand champion. Here he is, Reality Pales, the last man standing. And is he wearing Ninja War G4's outfit? <laughs> he stole his outfit. <laughs> well, anyway, here he is. Grand Champion, Reality Pales, the last man standing. Face with rumbling dice. I'm gonna fix it for the next tournament, and I'm gonna have a little, uh, uh, maybe a couple of blocks showing that how many times you have to rumble before you get to that point, and then one last rumble to the end. Or past those points. Anyway. He's rumbling the dice. He's done it at least three times this time, so now he's allowed to drag it and get to the end. Oh, and he's the edge of that. Believe it or not, that is allowed. Anyway, he's now onto the Skittles grasp. He's taking his time with his jumps. Alright, he's onto the green one. Got two more to go. Plan it, prepare to make his jump. He's on it. The last one, this is the farthest of them all. Oh, barely slip. He hangs onto it. That's why it's called the Grasp. Now he takes on the Shriveling and Kind cl Cliffhanker. He's being through it too. Oh no, and he falls between the small, smallest and the second plane! <laughs> oh, it's all over. Look at the replay. Yeah, he tried to go through it fast, but it just didn't work out for him. And that puts an end to Tournament 6. But 100 challengers took on the course, and we are only 10 managed to make it to Stage 2. Then seven were taken down, and three managed to make it to stage three, but even they were defeated. And with their defeat, that puts an end to this tournament. The competitors were taken down by the Shriveling Incline Cliffhanger. We'll wrap up this tournament by taking out the top 20, where your net number one goes to Ninja Warrior G4 with Grand Champion Reality Pales following, and then Dusk War 10 getting number third. Gossip Pro holding 10th place for getting the least farthest of uh, the stage one survivors. Then former Stage 2 finalists Sensei Sensei and Bumpy Shiratori hold 17 and 18 with two numbers just behind them. And of course ahead of them is just 95 Mike, holding up 15. And Mike for 15 holding the farthest for timing out. And that puts an end to Ninja Warrior Roblox Tournament 6. In the Competitors Unite Tournament, where all 100 challengers took on the course, and in the end, all 100 were defeated. And with Tournament 7 yet to come, Will we see someone defeat at least stage 3 and make it, maybe make it to stage 4, maybe see a new grand champion? We'll find it when it comes around. In the meantime, go check out my other videos, and be sure to come into the qualifying course when the tournament starts. And if it's already done, then be sure to stick around for Tournament 7 when it officially airs.
But until that time, the Ninja Warrior Roblox 7 to come. Stay tuned for more insane competitors, more extreme obstacles, and more Ninja Warrior of Roblox. Until next time, ciao peoples.